Hey y'all, it's Lost Forgotten Angel, also known as Sarah, and I am here to give my calculating it out. I am on week 16, going into week 17. I think I, the last video I posted, I think I might have been off on weeks, maybe not, I don't remember. But anyways, um, weighed in today at 194, which is excellent, because at the beginning of the week I was 197.8. So 194.6, I believe. So about three pounds. Yay! Anyways, um, that's exciting. And um, this is my first week back on the whole diet thing, like strictly watching points, logging them. I have a really bad habit of logging them at night, like remembering what I've done throughout the day and then logging it. Um, I hate that. I really hate that just because then I spend like an hour of my night trying to calculate out points, get it logged, ah, sorry my nose itched, and all that fun stuff and it's kind of annoying because then I have to try to remember. <laughs> but hopefully I'll get back on track. It's on my phone so I have it around me always. Um, it's my nose so let's see, I'm in pajamas so don't mind me but this is my tummy it's all bloated out again a little bit. And then my little pooch I got. I hate that. But anyways, so yeah. Fantastic. Anyways, um that's where I'm at. Everything basically still looks the same. Um, which I'm okay with. I had gained some weight, so I'm back on track to where I was before we moved. Um, hopefully it'll stay that way. I have discovered root beer floats. Now that I've discovered them, I have rediscovered them because now I have them with diet root beer, which I believe is zero points. And then I just do a little bit of vanilla ice cream, which I think if I calculate it out right, it's like three points for a serving or something like that with the ice cream that I have. So that's great because I can have a six point float for dessert and um, be happy with that. That's completely satisfying. Um, so other than that, I've um, been really sticking to the program, uh, sticking to the meals. Um, I love the Lean Cuisine stuffed cabbage. don't know if I've said this before or not, but I have like five of them in my freezer right now. I think I only have one egg roll. Not so good, but it's better than, I'm a really big eater. So that's what makes this diet, this whole points thing, extremely difficult because I'm really picky. If I don't like it, guess what? I won't eat. And if I don't eat, I'm a diabetic, I get very cranky. Extremely cranky. And so that's not good and it's not fair to everybody. So I'm trying to work on that um, with expanding my diet. And um, unfortunately, I turned to a lot of bread the week before and bread's not really good. The whole point of this, the Weight Watchers, is to teach you how to eat, not necessarily just to eat a little bit here and there, but to eat good portions of good stuff and not so huge portions of bad stuff. You still have it, just don't have a lot of it. I mean, it's, it's that simple, but it's not as easy to put into action. <laughs> um, other than that, I've been getting more active this week. I haven't started my yoga or anything yet. I'm going to start that this upcoming week, start my exercising all over again. Um, been spending a lot of time with my kiddos with trying to teach them some school stuff which is important more important than me exercising so sorry but if it comes down to what do I have more time for it's gonna be my kiddos so I'm sure parents out there everywhere can understand anyways um but yeah I was just working on the schooling stuff like that um, getting more active we have stairs so I can go up and down the stairs all day long and usually do um, doing laundry. I've been doing a lot better on housework, which I'm so happy. I don't know if it's because we actually have a house that I love now, or if it's because I want to be more active. Not sure. Either way, I'm happy with the fact that I'm getting up more and getting more stuff done. Can't really play outside a lot just because it's so hot and humid here. My kids run around for like five or ten minutes and then they're completely beat red. So then they gotta come inside and cool off. So we have like 15 minute play times outside. I mean, it's sad, but until their bodies can get used to it, if ever, I don't want my kids dying of heat stroke or something. So um, they get really red. If you know me, you see my kids, you understand that that's for, there's a good reason why I bring them inside once they start getting red. Um, except Morgan doesn't seem to do it, but she's just the baby, so that doesn't count. Um, let's see. 
Oh, so I happen to love, I think it's called Raisin Nut Bran or something like that. And it is delicious. It's got these little nut or these little um, raisins that are coated in something that's so good. And it's got slices of almonds and then it's got like the bran flakes. Yeah, the only problem is it's almost double the points. You bastards. You took Raisin Bran cereal. It's horrible. I mean, it's bad point-wise. It's It sucks. Like, it's good. I love, like, Raisin Bran, Raisin Nut Bran. That stuff's so good. So bad. You realize that Apple Jacks is better for you at the point system than Raisin Nut Bran? Are you kidding me? Captain Crunch, better for you than Raisin Nut Bran. Freaking, oops, all berries is better for you. I mean, all the cereal. I bet you even the Rice Krispie Treat cereal is better for you than Raisin Nut Bran point-wise. Because the majority of cereals, except for this one, have all been the same points. Yeah. And the one I happen to like the best. Other than Special K Chocolatey Delight, that crap is fantastic. I'm going to have to get that again. I was getting it too often and I got sick of it, but I'm going to start getting it again. Because that stuff is so good. Anyways, um... Oh, sorry, my nose itched. Yeah, rambling on. Anyway, so four pounds lost this week, adding in more exercise, drinking a lot more water. I dropped a lot of my diet soda that I was drinking. We now ha I have a 12 pack to last me two weeks, about. Uh, so that's great because it limits me to about one a day, which is way better than the two, three, and four a day that I was having. Um, other than that, and drinking more water and just getting up and more active, we're going to see where we go from here, guys. I know I keep saying I'm going to post my measurements, but to be honest with you, I've tried to do this video about five times now, and my measurement book is upstairs. So next time, if I remember, I will post my measurements of before and where I'm at now, and we shall see where I am. All right, guys. Take care.